If you thought compact drones had reached their limit, think again. The DJI NEO 2 is here to rewrite what's possible for a small, lightweight flying camera. At first glance, it might look like a cute little gadget built for beginners, but underneath its 151-gram frame lies a stunning combination of power, intelligence, and cinematic potential. DJI has managed to fit features once reserved for its premium lineup into this miniature marvel, making the Neo 2 not just a toy for enthusiasts, but a serious creative tool for anyone who loves capturing life from above. The first thing that grabs your attention is its camera system. Armed with a 1.3-inch CMOS sensor, the Neo 2 delivers crisp, detailed shots at around 12 megapixels. But it's the video capabilities that make JAWS drop. 4K at 60 frames per second, and even 4K slow motion at 100 frames per second. For such a small drone, this is an incredible leap in quality. Thanks to the two-axis gimbal stabilization, the gimbal keeps your shots balanced and stable even in light winds. The Focus Track suite now includes a clever new cycling mode that anticipates movement, perfect for bikers or fast-moving scenes. You also get spotlight and point-of-interest modes that allow the drone to automatically frame your subject and maintain perfect composition while you focus on the creative side of things. But the real magic of the Neo 2 lies in its ability to create cinematic moments at the tap of a button. Selfie shot, master shots, quick shots, and even dolly zoom bring professional camera moves to everyday users. Gesture control makes all of this easier. Simply raise your hand and the drone recognizes your motion to start recording or take a photo. Palm takeoff and landing mean you don't even need a runway. For safety and control, DJI has equipped the Neo 2 with omnidirectional obstacle sensing, a huge upgrade for a drone this small. Combined with a max tracking speed of 12 meters per second, about 27 miles per hour, it manages to feel agile yet remarkably secure in the air. Battery life clocks in at around 19 minutes, which is perfectly balanced for quick, creative flights. Switch to DJI's powerful O4 system, and that range skyrockets to 10 kilometers. Plus, the Neo 2 packs 49 gigabytes of internal storage, meaning you can record high-quality footage without constantly swapping memory cards. It's a small but thoughtful addition that makes it even more travel-friendly. The DJI Neo 2 will be available in three bundles. The Fly Solo bundle, priced at $259, is perfect for beginners. The Fly More combo, at $429, adds the RCN3 controller and two extra batteries. The Motion Fly More combo, priced at $599, includes the Advanced DJI Goggles 3 and RC Motion 3 controller, delivering a fully immersive flight experience. In essence, the DJI Neo 2 feels like the perfect fusion of simplicity and sophistication. It's the pocket-sized future of effortless creativity. Something big is coming, and if the whispers are true, the DJI Avata is about to change everything we thought we knew about FPV drones. Leaks from Chinese social media have already given us our first glimpse, and wow, it looks nothing like its predecessor. The bulky orange bumpers, gone. The chubby shell, gone. What we're looking at now is a sleeker, sharper, and fiercely aerodynamic beast built for speed, agility, and cinematic perfection. The Avata isn't just about looks. DJI has completely re-engineered its balance by shifting the battery backward, opening up the front for a new camera system that's rumored to house a full 1-inch CMOS sensor. That's a huge leap, meaning richer colors, deeper shadows, and ultra-crisp low-light footage. Imagine flying through a forest at sunset, or diving between skyscrapers at night. Your footage will finally look as epic as it feels. DJI's pattern hints at something big, dropping between November 2025 and January 2026. The pricing still under wraps, but insiders say it'll land in the premium zone, likely around $1,400 to $1,600 for the base kit. Performance upgrades are just as thrilling. Early reports suggest up to 30 minutes of flight time, a huge boost over the previous model's 23 minutes. And stabilization. DJI might finally break its FPV tradition with a mechanical gimbal, 
paired with enhanced Rocksteady and Horizon Steady systems. That means even during wild FPV dives or rapid twists, your footage stays buttery smooth, like it was shot on rails. Safety's getting smarter too. The Avada is expected to feature 360-degree obstacle avoidance. For new pilots, that's peace of mind. For pros, it's creative freedom to fly bolder, closer, and faster. With AI-assisted flight modes, an upgraded DJI RC Motion 3 controller, and the sleek new DJI Goggles 3, this drone isn't just about flying. It's about feeling every moment in the sky. If these leaks hold true, the DJI Avada isn't just another FPV drone. It's the one that will make every pilot, creator, and filmmaker fall in love with flight all over again. Leaked promotional footage has revealed the upcoming DJI Osmo Action 6, showcasing what appears to be a major leap forward for the Osmo series. The star of the show is its rumored 1.1-inch CMOS sensor with a variable f2.0 to f4.00 aperture, promising sharper, more dynamic shots in any lighting condition. After months of speculation, the Osmo Action 6 finally surfaces following DJI's recent releases, the Osmo 360 and the compact Osmo Nano. Now, all eyes are on this next-gen action cam, expected to bring professional-grade imaging to a pocket-sized powerhouse. Leaker Igor Bogdanov has shared what seems to be DJI's first official promotional image, hinting that the Action 6 can record 4K video at 30 frames per second for up to two hours on a 1,950 milliamp hour battery. The new teaser also suggests that DJI is preparing a global launch soon. Rumored price of around $329, the Osmo Action 6 could redefine what compact adventure cameras are capable of blending endurance, clarity, and cutting-edge design in one sleek package. Bright, sun-drenched scenes like beaches or snowy slopes, narrowing to f4.0 keeps your footage smooth and cinematic without the hassle of ND filters. When the light fades at sunset or in dim environments, opening to f2.0 brightens your shot and reduces noise, delivering crisp, clean visuals. It's the kind of flexibility that filmmakers and advanced users have been waiting for in a compact form. Design-wise, DJI has made thoughtful refinements. The familiar pill-shaped element beneath the front screen is gone, replaced by a minimalist white square beside the Action logo. This subtle change isn't just cosmetic. The color temperature sensor, once hidden in the O of the Action logo, likely lives there now. The result is a sleeker, more cohesive front design. A tiny new dot next to the logo hints at a possible new component, perhaps an ambient light sensor for automatic screen brightness or a discrete microphone hole. If it's the former, this would be DJI's first move to separate display brightness control from the main camera sensor. Overall, DJI's philosophy shines through. Evolution, not revolution. Every tweak feels deliberate, every detail refined. With its adjustable aperture, elegant design, and smarter sensors, the Osmo Action 6 signals DJI's intent to elevate the action camera game once again. Multiple trusted sources have confirmed the leaks, and we already have real product images, plus the core specs in hand. DJI isn't playing safe this year. They're going bold with a near 1-inch camera sensor, delivering a huge upgrade in low-light performance and dynamic range. Paired with a variable aperture, this thing is stepping into cinema territory, letting creators nail exposure and achieve deeper, more dramatic background blur. Battery life, DJI is rewriting the rules with a massive 4-hour runtime. 